Scotland's got very firm foundations for independence. That's the conclusion of this report produced by the Scottish Government. Uh, there are three uh, very important arguments made in this report. The first one is that Scotland is a very wealthy nation. We, we all accept that. We all understand it. Uh, and the, the Government looks at uh, Scotland's finances uh, at the moment and looking forward to the point where we become independent. And what it shows is that in various scenarios, uh, Scotland's public finances would be better than, or at least as good as, those of the UK. And that should give us a great deal of confidence as we move to the vote in September that, yes, we can uh, be an independent country. We have the, the wealth and resources to, to make that decision. Secondly, the report also shows why we should be independent. Um, one of the most pow powerful reasons for choosing a yes vote is the ability to make different choices here in Scotland. We can choose a different path. And that also includes challenging the austerity agenda that exists down south. And so what this report shows is that by increasing public spending on key services like the health service and creating more opportunities here in Scotland, we can actually uh, choose a different spending path. We can increase spending by 3% uh, as compared to the 1% proposed by the UK government. Uh, so we can move away from that damaging and dangerous austerity agenda within the first few years of independence. And that's an important understanding from this paper. Finally, uh, the paper also shows us why we must be independent. Uh, this is a graph towards the end of the paper, and the blue line shows what would happen to Scotland's debt, national debt, if nothing changes, if we remain part of the same constitutional arrangements. And as you can see, it uh, rises to unsustainable levels, uh, much larger than uh, the size of our economy. The, the red and the green lines are what would happen to Scotland's debt if we increase our population, uh, increase employment, and take steps to grow our economy, our productivity. And that moves Scotland onto a sustainable line where we are more financially secure in the future. So that's why a yes vote is so important. We can be independent, we should be independent, and we must be independent. And that's the clear conclusion of this report today.